outside. No invitation is needed to enter this building. That can't be a good sign. No sign of a struggle. It seems Charlotte's friend knew the killer and let him in. Emily wanted to become a vampire. Something must have gone wrong. Someone is responsible for blood. I should follow the trail. Blood. Emily, where you are, baby? Level twenty four, I can manage that. Do work, Jonathan. Do work. Who are you? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. I'm the Marquis de Bois Colomb, and I strongly invite you to find your own game, sir. I'm not here to sustain myself. I'm currently investigating the death of a young woman killed by a vampire. A young woman killed by a vampire? Oh, <laughs> you're joking, right? Oh, I do love the British sense of humor. And who exactly are you? I am Jacques-Michel Guillaume Florimond, the Marquis de Bois-Colombe, at your service, my dear cousin. You're French, but your English is quite good. I was born in France, sir, but I consider myself a traveler of this world. Mm, so many countries, so many tantalizing tastes. Dear cousin, are we related? We could be of the same blood, my dear. I tend to consider all Econs as family, don't you? What are you doing here? I recently decided to visit London. I've always dreamed of visiting a city on the verge of collapse. Such a delicate, yet intense spectacle. You take pleasure from others' misery. I have been a totally depraved and immoral creature since the day I was reborn, sir. And probably before. What do you plan to do here? Take pleasure. Take pictures. Enjoy the show. Have fun. Believe me, I won't be the only foreign immortal who bought a ticket to the fair. I followed the trail of blood from her room to here. Oh, you're referring to that young woman. Yes, the meeting turned messy. I'm afraid I ruined my last wedding coat. So you admit you murdered her? I admit nothing, my good sir. I only regret the blood of that girl staining my clothes. Oh, blood can be so messy. What happened? She wanted to become one of us. Not the first time I have received such a proposal, but uh, I must admit her direct approach tempted me. And then what? The body rejected my blood. It happens, you know, sometimes even with voluntary prey. At least her gurglings brought me some fun until so the up. artery burst. I believe you, sir. Emily's diary confirms your statement. Oh, Emily was her name. Quite charming. Well, mystery solved then. Yes, I suppose so. You can go. And so can you. Farewell, sir. May you enjoy the spectacle of this fallen city as much as I do. Should I tell what's her face? Uh, I'll probably tell it about. Yeah, about tell her why she shouldn't mess with the vampires.
there's no guarantee that you'll survive the procedure. Okay. Back to the West End. Um, let's go talk to Emily. Oh, not Emily. What's her face? What's her face? You know what I'm talking about. That's a crazy lady, right? With the rats? Yeah. I'm gonna go look around to this side. Maybe there's someone else that I didn't see here. I know video games, there should be a third possible location to reach. Choose one of three. I'm sure Kaloon Russell has no interest in such a conventional menu. That was an option. Kaloon. Why are vampire hunters sniffing around here? I need to find out what they're after. That precedes the story. I got an update on your friend. Right to vote good. Is good evening, Miss Ashbury. And good evening to you, Dr. Reed. I have found out what happened to your friend, Emily. I can handle the truth. There's no need to hide the bloody details. Your friend was planning to become a vampire. She thought she'd met an honest one and made a deal with him. Unfortunately, Emily did not survive the process. My mother told me many times about the risks of being turned. I often suspected she exaggerated the danger to avoid me being tempted. No, the risk is real. Have you any idea what a body has to endure to become an organism entirely consumed by its need to process and recombine blood? I should never have talked to Emily about vampires. I never thought she'd actually try it without me. Thank you, sir. Here, take this for your discretion. Ooh, new weapon. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? A few days ago, I spotted a strange house while campaigning for women's suffrage. Awful smell. No answer when I knocked. Where is it? It's the Mullaney's. A nice family who live in a big house near the park in the eastern part of this neighborhood. Goodbye, Charlotte. Give my best regards to your mother when you see her. She's been quite busy these last few nights. That add another one. Good evening. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Have you noticed anything unusual? Well, not really. Wait, now that you mention it, I don't see the McPhersons in my favorite restaurants. They love delicate meals too, you understand. Thank you. It may be nothing, but I'll investigate anyway. Where do they live? They have a house in the southern part of the district, somewhere north of the railway bridge. There is a courtyard, if I remember rightly. Goodbye. It's people all telling me the same thing. It's one of two houses. Don't... Good evening, old chap. I won't. I'm investigating the source of the epidemic in this district. Can you help me? Infection is everywhere these days. If you ever go to the park near that swanky house belonging to the, the Mullaney's. Yes? What about the Mullaney's? What about their house? Not enough noise for a big family with children. Not enough movement. Closed doors. What is going on in there? You need some. 
talk to his wife. I thought that the next dialogue option was for him, but it's actually for his wife. One second. Uno momento. I'm just gonna barge in here. Hello, Venus. Hello. What did it's, no, never mind, it's still locked up. Mary came here with locked up. Okay, so we have two options here. We can either go I'll go get this hideout first. So go around this go down the street, make a left, then make another left. That building is under quarantine. Could this be what I'm looking for? Level 20. <gasps> um... Level 22, I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh shit! Freaking bloater. Stop throwing up on me, it's so gross. Stop. Why only do you throw up on me? Keep him off kilter. I got the heal on it. Oh. I gotta take time to. Uh... Oh, God. Really? Really? Uh, I could have killed that guy. Try to kill this lady again. Let's see if I hit them both. Ow, ow, ow. God. Still getting hurt by her stupid thing. Next hits free. Pour it on, baby.
Nope. Not yet. Hide out! I don't know, this is what I'm supposed to investigate here. Rested up, leveled up. Try this again. Oh, what the hell, dude? That one just pops out of nowhere? That's a bullshit. People regenerating. That's bull. Run! Oh, I lock that door. It's not gonna let me. Survive right now. Nice counter. Oh my god. Go invincibility frames. the eyes is a big problem right now. Gotcha. I got gotcha, you, bitch. Got it. Much better. There we go. Oh, amazing what two levels do. Now I can investigate the stupid house. Let me open this gate first, though. The door has been unlocked. Purple, my first purple. Cook that baby. Remove this. Um, I 
I still I can't use the same stake. Fine, whatever. Oh, there you go. Oh, wait, that means I can just. going on here oh they're infected man I gotta do work nullified what he nullified what the bullshit is that Are built. Oh shit. Just leaving trails around here. Gotta be careful. Blood, Amy. Man, I really should have got an L2. Up to a building. He's almost dead. To kill him. Easier. Just gotta keep up with the regenerations. You're not resistant to the blades. No, you aren't. Okay. Almost there, Roger. Roger, Dodger. Priscilla, it's just you and me, lady. Nom 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 nom. Man, that attack assumes that they stay in the same spot. I don't know about that. Let's swap that around. Nah, 
Bow down. Get her! I've never seen such a radical mutation. Could it be a new stage in the disease's evolution? Man, I would have been real cheesed if I would have died there. Trick apart. I got some blood samples, right? Large pill box. Silver mirror. So the husband had an affair with Doris Fletcher. Number one done. It's number two left. 2000 XP, baby. Been in this room already. Okay, one down. Through here and through the park, right? To the right? Yeah. Women of all countries unite! Visible. Man. Now we do a cleansing. This woman's body has multiple lacerations. They're deep, too. Whoever did this was driven by rage. Crazy man. Or are you crazy man? He had his tongue removed and his eyes gouged out. He was a victim of brutal torture. Jesus. This family had a bad day, to say the least. This one's neck is broken. He was young. Probably the son. Cutscene. Virgil, he's back.
thought I was dead too, didn't you? No, I was just pretending. No, I Dad didn't. Told me I could have been a great actress. You killed your family. They mocked my talent. Please. Resist. Oh, I have no blood levels, so why can't I do any attacks? No blood. Knock your ass down, bitch. Is this this? Oh, careful. No, why did I keep that? Back up, back up, Jonathan. Come on, dude. Again. So I can either play it safe, or just wait for yeah, I'll play it safe. Play the safe game. Two seconds. Boom. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. So, this girl took lessons at the famous Doris Fletcher acting school. New dialogue available for Dr. Mrs. Ashbury. We can evolve as well. Doris Fletcher seems to be the missing link here. It can't just be a coincidence. I should go to her acting school. The hell's outside this door? That was weird. Oh shit. This is where I was a second ago. Okay. Should I talk to Lady Ashbury first? Yes. This way, I forgot there's a shortcut back here. 